and it feels like it's impossible to film today. <laughs> There's so, so many sounds everywhere. If I go in the house, you hear the news, and no one wants to hear that right now. It's a lot of negativity, and I don't want to go into any of that right now. Um, and cars keep going by because, like, of where I live. So I'm just going to do this part of the video. So I'm trying to go a little bit quick, a little bit quick, making this whole video without editing any of it because my Adobe Premiere keeps crashing on me. And I, yeah, I don't, I just want to get these videos out there. Um, because I feel like I can't put everything where it should go unless I get these videos done. So yeah, these, this, is, this is the second part of the Ireland, um, Ireland haul. So, we're just going to do this in one go. And I might slur my words, I might stutter. Oh well. Um... We're going to start with Killarney. Actually, no, we'll start with Dublin. So, I made this video earlier, but then, um, Photo Booth just didn't record any of it. So, here we go again. <laughs> this is from Dublin from Temple Bar. This is from my fairy garden. Really, really cute. Um, I want the people who live there to be, like, fairies and gnomes and, um, woodland creatures. And, um, I was even thinking, uh... I don't know about mermaids, but, um, yeah, I was thinking, like, you know, leprechauns, gnomes, fairies, yeah. It was really cute. You know, so I think, like, I think three euros. That was, like, the last night in Temple Bar. This one is from the Cook Some More. And it's, like, if you notice, there's, like, some blue on the feathers. Anytime I saw puffins, I needed to buy it because puffins aren't common around here. You only see them up in Maine or in certain parts of New England, so it's kind of like they're hard to find. But yeah, they're very, very cute. They're not related to the penguins, if you're wondering. Let's see that. Oh, it's upside down. Sorry. Yeah, so they're so cute. They're going to go on my mantle. That's what I was originally thinking. I am debating if any should go on, like, not on, but like in my fairy garden. Next, we have. Uh, also, I have filmed a, a fairy, so if you guys just saw that, yeah, there's that too. So these ones are from Killarney. We went from Killarney to visit Dingle, and I got, I went to this little craft, it was kind of like a handmade artist place, and the, the back says the name. This was just so cute, caught my eye, so, so, so cute. He just looks like, what, like, are you looking at me? Like, I don't want to get up. I'm not going to get up. <laughs> Stay comfy. Here's the back. So, yeah. If you're curious and you want to go, yeah. Three hedgehogs. And I gave those to my friends Atlas and Astrid. So, watching. <laughs> yeah, I got the puffin. And it's made of a type of clay. It feels like horse and like a breakable. I'm not sure, but here's the bottom. So... I love these a lot. I think they'd be very cute in my mantle. I think they'd also be cute in the fairy garden, but I'm nervous because we get squirrels. I don't want, like, I don't know. I, I'm very tempted to keep the fairy garden in the house, but I want it to be outside, but I'm afraid of squirrels, so it's like I have to meet problems. Um, or maybe if I had, like, a glass case out here, but then I have to be worried about, like, like mean teenagers breaking it. But I don't know. Maybe I should get a glass case. I have these shelves. And I got them from um, a beach on the way to In um, the beach on the way to Dingle. I don't know if it was Inch Beach. I'm not 100 sure. So don't quote me. Finally, they had these um, toy machine things, and I like it because the coins go to charity, so you get to pick. And I got a little slime ball. Okay. I mean, I know you can't eat it because there you sniffed it. So it's like, got this shell. Cool. They're very, they're very, very smooth shells. There's this one. I do collect shells and rocks, which is also kind of nice. But I'm not sure where these are going to go yet. I love the colors on these. The way it, like, the light hits it. They also look like little plates. So I stacked these. They look like this. 
I've never seen these kind of shells before. They're just like a little water basin is what it looks like. Or a tiny bath. They're very, very smooth. And here's the back. Could be a hat too. Like this one would look really cool. There. Also, a possible hat. Hey. <laughs> I don't know. Like the garden. Very, very small. I have this one. Very, very. Also cute. And it has a tiny hole, so I'm going to make it into a necklace. And then an even smaller one. And then this one. And it's black on the inside, which I've never seen before. So that's pretty cool. And then I got this cool rock from the rock collection. This video, I filmed it outside because um, that was my idea for today to film outside. And it's been a rainy day. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you later. Thank you guys so much for watching.